So our undergraduate degree is three years long and our master's degree is four years long. What we do is we start in the first year with the real foundations of computer science. So that's things like the mathematics and the underlying hardware designs that go together to really make computers. From that first year, we move forward into looking more at programming and more into um, more advanced topics in year two. And then in year three, it's really about going into the specifics, into applications. So these are things like cybersecurity, artificial intelligence, and things like that. Every single one of our modules has some kind of practical element. So for mathematical modules, they might be working together in like a seminar format. But obviously we have a lot of hardware related stuff where students are actually building things on real bits of hardware. So in the first year, uh, we do a little bit of that. In the second year, we start to move into a bit more. And then by the time you get to the third year, you'll be choosing a sort of project that really interests you, which could be anything from some kind of cybersecurity related thing, or maybe you're really interested in building some unusual custom hardware. And then you'll go away and actually make that. And we have a dedicated lab specifically for those students who are wanting to work on those projects in their own time. The university has a variety of support mechanisms for international students. We have dedicated hardware and software laboratories for students working on software or hardware projects. We have two software labs for all undergraduates. They're open 24 hours a day. We have hardware labs like the one that we're in now. We also have specific master's labs for students who are working on master's programs and other sort of advanced projects. So they have their own space as well. So obviously computer science is a really wide discipline uh, that is really important in industry at the moment. Nearly about 97% of our graduates when they've uh, about a year and a half after graduation are in full-time employment or further study. And they are going into all kinds of different jobs, basically dependent on how they chose to specialise their programme.